Hello and welcome my beautiful Libras. This is your general tarot and oracle card forecast for the week of May the 13th to the 19th. And general means not every single card or the energy they carry may resonate with every single one of you, but some of it will. So take what does and throw the rest out into the universe. So starting off with your download message for this week, you've got sitting in the seat of power. So Libra, we've been talking about this for a while where you may be stepping up, leveling up, taking over um, and being in control and being, uh, you know, your own boss, your own director, uh, supervisor. Uh, you know, maybe this is your own business. Maybe you're stepping up uh, a level here on the rung and you're being, uh, you know, self-employed now. You're your own entrepreneur. But regardless of that, you're sitting in the seat of power, even if it has to do with a personal issue where <clears throat> there may be debates, discussions and conversations and communications going on where you're in control of where that conversation goes. So take the lead, my friends. Don't be afraid to take the steering wheel and step up and be the leader. Coming in with your first card, you've got flexibility. So you'll be you'll need to see in the dark to maneuver the coming changes. While it seems extreme, just hang in there. Uh, you know, this too shall pass. Something new could be happening uh, this week and you'll have to find a way to get around it. There could be changes at work. Maybe you're going to go into work and they're going to say somebody's off and you need to step up to the plate and take over an extra position and do your work and theirs. Um, it could be a situation where an appointment gets changed on your schedule, on your calendar that you have to be flexible about. Um, it's definitely something that's going to come in that's going to be a temporary situation. You're going to have to uh, be more, um, you know, balanced and be more flexible with, okay? So being able to maneuver around these changes. You could be having to deal with money issues this week. You could be juggling your calendar, juggling your time management, uh, you know, trying to make decisions and choices. But there could be a lot of balls in the air as well while you're juggling here, trying to get things sorted out, my beautiful. <clears throat> my beautiful uh, Libras. So yeah, you've got the power here to uh, create something if you if you take care of your time management, okay? Because you might feel as though there's just too much going on right now. And you're going to have to evaluate some areas in your life that need to change and set your intentions to create a more balanced lifestyle. You could be taking on more than you, you know, you can chew right now. So be mindful of that. You're manifesting something here. You have the power to, uh, to manifest something and what you, you want by writing your intentions down and by taking inspired action to make it happen. So moving forward <clears throat> in a progressive direction here. I do think that you have this ability to pretty much create what it is you want this week by being flexible, uh, by being uh, more conscientious about time management and manifesting what you want. But sometimes we have to actually write it down, script it, uh, and be able to read it and say it a few times so that we really set that intention in our mind to take action and go after what we want. Uh, the, you know, it isn't going to happen unless we take those first few steps. Now you've got the justice card and the justice Justice card says that something's going to level out here for you. There could be some situation of misunderstandings or there could be a situation here where you have to say, I'm not getting involved in this drama or this, this incident. Uh, you could also be dealing with maybe a legal issue here where justice is going to be waived and it's going to be waived in your favor. So you could be manifesting something here when it comes to a legal action uh, where you're wanting to see your, your uh, you win the case or get what you deserve or you know a settlement or whatever the case is but you're going to see a judicial issue here for some of you that will work out in your favor <clears throat> now you may have to be a little bit more there might be have might be compromise issue in this situation as well uh, things could change a little bit but it you know you'll be able to see a clear sight line now when this comes to uh, comes to pass You've got <clears throat> roll the dice in the center position. So it's time to put yourself out there. You're hiding your talents and it's time to take a risk and step out into the spotlight. So don't be afraid because they're coming in with that is the Ace of Wands. And this is an absolutely beautiful card of, uh, of new beginnings, a card of taking the advantage of a situation or an offer that's coming into you. And the Aces, Aces are the beginning. 
things of everything but this particular suit says get ready get ready to hear about some new exciting situation coming into your life but you've got to step up to the plate and accept it you've got to step forward and don't be afraid to roll that dice and do something new okay something new and exciting is about to enter your life and it could be maybe a new job a new raise or a financial windfall but it could also be this new placement here of position at your place of employment for some of you so this is all about you uh, being willing to uh, to go towards your goals here. Don't be afraid to say yes and roll the dice and, and step up to the plate because something new is coming in and it may be uh, giving you this ability to sit in the seat of power, having more authority, uh, being a, in control of a situation, having the resources here to do and make plans on your terms so this is really interesting now coming in next you've got the real passion card stop wasting time in dead-end jobs and find your true passion it's fine to experiment but don't settle for less than you truly deserve so everything that glitters isn't gold you <clears throat> you are learning that lesson I can see uh, but you've worked hard for where you are and if you're not getting the rewards and the return uh, for the efforts and the time that you have uh, committed to a situation or your job or your career you may be thinking about moving on to something new uh, and that is you know stepping up to the plate and taking charge now of the direction you want to see yourself go especially if it comes to being in you know <clears throat> comes to your job and a situation but also it shows a couple here and again don't settle don't settle for a pretty face and a charming personality there's more depth to an individual than that okay so if it is a relationship do your research be sure that this person is uh, has integrity and this person is who they are portraying to be now with this you've got the knight of swords and the knight of swords is energy charging towards your goals charging towards something that happens very quickly this is you getting excited to go headstrong towards a goal or a situation right now. But be careful. Um, you you know you need to pull back on the reins a little bit. You as exciting and as passionate as you are about a situation that comes in quick, hot and heavy. You need to pull back on the reins to be sure of the moves that you're making. Be sure of the changes that you're making. Be sure of your decisions and choices that you're making. Uh, now, if there's a legal situation going on, be careful. Read between the lines once you sign the ink hits the paper it's a done deal beware consumer coming in next you have drama <clears throat> beware of troublemakers in the workplace the job you may have uh you know the job the job you want may have too much upheaval to bear keep emotions and gossip in check so we've all been you know subjected to this type of energy in our places of work uh and this could be why you're thinking about making a change charging towards something else but i think you're going to be sitting in the seat of power to realize that you you're not going to take on the drama of other people or you're going to call a mediation and a meeting where you can sit down and discuss this and what the rules should be and that people can't bring their problems to work but, but someone there could be stirring the pot up and they may want to drag you into the equation uh, to have verification that what they're doing is right uh, and in essence it's not so be careful uh, you know be mindful uh, that you are not enabling anybody to create this drama in the workplace it's toxic it poisons the environment coming in with the next card you've got the moon and again this is about you tr this is the energy of Pisces but you and maybe you're dealing with this water sign <clears throat> that could be very dramatic right now and, and maybe there's a problem but uh, right now Libra I think that you are going to have to trust your gut instincts and your intuition here uh, you know as you move through look how dark this drama card is and look how bright the moon card is so this is about you being able to do your research here uh, you've learned from the past that gossip doesn't pay off uh, that drama doesn't pay off and you're not going to get involved because it's uh, you know you're going to be subjected to this but I think you're going to do your research step up into the seat of power and you're going to clear the air here you're going to voice your opinion and and you're going to either you know you're going to be able to deal with this don't get caught up in an illusion or be blinded by something here I told you there could be some somebody here who's trying to charm you into something uh, and con you into something and make you agree to something that they're doing or that they want to drag you into so uh, <clears throat> being aware of you know being able to do your research looking in behind the background checking things out so that you have the truth here to be able to deal with any problems at work with somebody who could be stirring the pot up right 
Well, my beautiful Libras, this is your general reading for this week, and I wish you a great remainder to today and a beautiful, optimistic, healthy, happy, and prosperous, successful week. And always know I send you lots of love and many blessings, and I'll see you soon, my beautiful Libras.